Meme coins have outperformed the entire crypto market in 2024, and it's projected that they're going to continue to outperform the market during this bull market. So whenever we start seeing Bitcoin, Ethereum rally this entire year, we have seen meme coins outperform every single sector. So while the market hasn't done too well over the last couple of weeks, while September is historically not a great time for crypto, it's actually a very good time to buy into pre-sale projects because they have set prices during the pre-sale. You continue to see the prices increase uh, periodically. And that is why I've been doubling down on Doge 2014. So Doge 2014 is a project that has raised over $300,000. When we did our video on it uh, a little while ago, they had raised just under 200, right around $200,000. This was only six days ago. So in the last week alone, while the market has had a bit of a correction, while things haven't looked too good, while there's been a little bit of FUD, we've actually seen them raise an additional $120,000. And the way that Doge 2014 is, is introducing itself, and trying to market itself as they say, look, introducing Doge 2014, celebrating 10 years of Dogecoin. And you can see all the information in their white paper, how ultimately they're trying to celebrate 10 years since Dogecoin started trading back in 2014. This is supposed to be designed for not only meme coin enthusiasts, but also Dogecoin enthusiasts and anyone in the crypto market, because they're saying, look, Dogecoin launched 10 years ago. It gained, you know, tens of billions of dollars in market cap, but a lot of the gains with it have been already been seen. So if you're looking for something that is, you know, a bit more affordable, has more potential long term, well, it's going to be something like Doge 2014, because with Doge 2014, if we look at a few things, we can see in terms of their tokenomics, there's a lot to really like about it. And you can see that, look, 100 billion tokens total. There is going to be a listing price of 0.000348. And that is significantly higher than where we're at right now, which is just 0.000306. And in terms of the token breakdown, you can see that there's 60% allocated to the pre-sale, which is an extremely high percentage, something that you really like to see for a project that is just launching because it shows that it's very much a community driven project and that it's not just that the team members have most of the supply and they're just going to dump it once it launches. No, it has 60% for pre-sale, 25% for staking, which again is driving community engagement, community rewards, 10% for liquidity allocation and 5% for marketing allocation. So with this token breakdown, vast majority supply is simply allocated to either, you know, pre-sale and raising money at the beginning, either rewards going to be with like staking and ensuring long-term adoption of this token or with marketing, which is again, growing and building out the community. So really, there's a lot that is allocated to simply building, growing, and maintaining this community. If we scroll down a little bit further, we can see that they also are doing another major thing in terms of the community. So like I said, first of all, they do have the token available on their website still for pre-sale. You can get it with ETH, USDT, card. You simply just have to connect your wallet. And we've talked about this in our past videos when we did a video on this just about a week ago. And we could see that the thing that's more important and very exciting, in my opinion, is in terms of this airdrop. So if you go ahead and click on airdrop, it says, look, the biggest Dogecoin airdrop of all time is here. Celebrate a decade of Dogecoin with us. And the way that it works is it says, look, how to score your free Dogecoin. Unlock VIP status. So that means you need to invest $1,000 or more in Doge 2014 tokens to secure VIP access and claim a portion of our incredible airdrop pool. The more you invest, the bigger your free, air, uh, free Dogecoin reward. Two is going to be raise the milestone. The airdrop gets rolling as soon as they hit their $500,000 goal. And the rest, easy, this airdrop won't impact the value of Doge 2014 tokens because ultimately it says, look, airdrop breakdown, 500,000 to 5 million raise, 2% of the total will be used to buy Dogecoin. Between 5 million and 8 million raise, 3% of the total will be used to buy Dogecoin. Between 8 million and 10 million, 4% of the total will be used to buy Dogecoin. And 10 million plus raised, 5% of the total will be used to buy Dogecoin. Dogecoin. So the more that is raised, ultimately, the more that's going to be contributed and bought, uh, like going to be used to buy Dogecoin. And that ultimately is going to benefit 
all of the people who have unlocked VIP status and all of these tokens that they're going to buy are simply going to be airdropped over to anyone who is on this leaderboard, who has invested $1,000 or more and has unlocked that VIP status. It says, look, ultimately, at the end of their presale, we'll purchase Dogecoin based on the total amount raised and distribute it to all VIPs according to their share of the airdrop pool. So it's very simple and easy because ultimately, it's just about, look, Based on how much you've invested, if you have invested over a thousand dollars, you automatically unlock this VIP status. And then based off of you know how much you invest, you're gonna get either a higher proportion or a smaller proportion of the Dogecoin airdrop that they're gonna conduct once they launch. And they talk all about this also on the roadmap because they say, look, in terms of the roadmap, it's broken up into four phases. Phase one is initiate the Doge 2014 project with a token pre-sale to celebrate Dogecoin and build a strong community foundation. That's where we are right now. And really then into phase two, it's expand the Doge 2014 community through marketing campaigns, partnerships, and social media engagement. So I guess we're sort of between one and two, either in one or two, just depending on how you look at it and how much they're actually going to go about raising. Phase three, officially launch the Doge 2014 token on major exchanges, ensuring widespread accessibility and adoption. And phase four, celebrate major achievements with community and plan for future developments and enhancements to the Doge 2014 ecosystem. So this is something that is very simple and easy to do. And you could see that not only have they had a leaderboard where people with VIP status have invested 22,000, 18,000, 13,000, a lot of people have invested well over $5,000, but also in terms of their stake you could see that there's been over 800 million uh, Doge 2014 token stake. So people really believe in this project long term. And you can see that out of the proportion of people who have bought the token, which is around $300,000 worth, there's been over 800 million tokens staked and generating, you know, that APY, which is well over a thousand percent. So this is something that is very, very exciting in my opinion. And I think it's why we've been able to see them get a ton of engagement on X. They're getting, you know, over 5,000 likes for a lot of their uh, 5,000 views for a lot of their posts. Most recent had 3,000. You could see 7,500, 6,000. You could see that they're getting these big name uh, collabs with like Kong trading and crypto gems. And because of all this and, uh, Combining this with what's going on with meme coins, I think we're going to continue to see this project well raise well over a few million dollars and launch when we see market conditions flip because they don't have a set market date just yet. But I would expect them to probably launch once you see the market flip, once you see a lot more excitement and money coming into the space. And if you are looking for a meme coin project, usually during periods of volatility right now, if you've invested in a token, we've seen a lot of things crash, but getting into a pre-sale is a bit better right now because you know it's at a certain price, you know you're buying it at a certain price, and they'll probably launch it when you see uh, market conditions improve a bit. So this project does have an audit that was done back in June. There was no major issues with it, and that is exactly what you want to see as an investor. So like I said, I did buy some of this token. I didn't buy, you know, fifty, sixty thousand dollars worth, but I did buy a small portion of this token because with things like this, when you see them launch, you see them do well, it only takes really one of these pre-sale projects to do extremely well to really make your entire meme coin portfolio increase dramatically in value. So that's why I do this. I talk a lot about different pre-sale projects and this is one that I did recently invest in.